you simple peons don't know that. Y'all don't watch the news. Y'all don't see what's going on, man. Yeah. All right? All they, they, all yeah. they, they get ready to celebrate Halloween. They get ready. Hey, if, if Lord if Lord Frogy tells you it's okay, you're going to go home for Thanksgiving. Come on. Christmas. Oh, look what they say. It's about, hey, yeah, ain't gonna be no damn Thanksgiving and Christmas, man. Yeah, ships ain't coming to shore. No. Nah. Yeah. What y'all, yeah, then what you gonna do? Right. You gonna try to seek the Lord then? Right. When you can't uh, 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 partake in a damn evil right. ass holiday? Right. It's gonna be too late. The Lord will look at you like a piece of stone that you are. That's right, brother. That's right, brother. Verse 22. Uh, a sign of battle is in the land and of great destruction. How is the hammer <laughs> of the whole earth cut asunder and broken? How did this happen? Yeah. How did America How get defeated? It How can it be? <laughs> yeah. Say it ain't so. Say it no, ain't so. All that stuff. No, man. Yeah. How's the hammer the whole earth broken? Right. And we clearly know which military has outposts yeah. like in in, 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 in in over 100 countries now. Right. Who, who could this be? Right. How's the hammer the whole earth broken? Come on. Yep. How's the hammer of the whole earth cut us under and broken? How is Babylon? That's, what, that's how you know it's talking about America. Hammer Babylon. Links. Links. <laughs> How is Babylon become a desolation among the nations? I have laid a snare for thee, and thou art also taken, O Babylon. Thou was not aware. Thou art found and also caught. Because thou hast striven against the Lord. This is why. This is why you're found and caught, man. Why, why are all these evils happening to y'all, man? Why is your economy flat mind? Why is there no opportunity? Why are you having to take this thing in order to be able to enter in the supermarket or in order to keep your job. Why is all this evil coming on you, man? Why? Why? There's got to be some kind of explanation for it. <laughs> got to be. Got to be. It has to. It has to. It has to be. And, and, and this is it. We're telling yeah, you. This, yeah, this is it. It's Judgment, it, it, man. And it's right over here. Watch, man. Through the spirit, man, the Lord, I mean, you know, uh, just speaking as a man, but once we're gone, man, this, shit go, this whole corner will be flooded, man. And, and my, the Lord might have to, well, we ride by the sea and like, dang. Oh shit. Fuck y'all. Now laugh at your calamity. Fuck y'all. Yeah, yeah. And mock when your fear comes. Right. Uh, verse uh, 25. The Lord have opened his armory yeah. and have brought forth the weapons of his indignation. For this is the work of the Lord, Yahweh of hosts, in the land of the Chaldeans. It's the work of the Lord, man. man come on, look, man. We, we out here. We just had a whole bunch of uh, uh, semen, right. Navy semen across the street, and we're talking about Babylon the Great Fall, and they ain't do a damn. They ain't even come up and say nothing. No, cause they're fucking through. That's how these are the people that's in your military. Yep. That's how you know it's a soft ass military. Say yeah. if it would have happened 50 years ago, that man, those people, uh, especially being Navy man, they'd have been brawling. Oh yeah. But but these oh, yeah. little man, come on man, you let women in your military. Right. Yeah, you 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 don't you know. All you need is a D average and a pulse to get into the, uh, to get into the Navy, man. Straight up. You know in the I mean? Army, like yeah. It's, it's easy as hell to get in. You used yeah. to have to kind of like a do, you yeah. had to be able to do something, man. Yeah. Even, you had to have certain scores. You said D average and a pulse. Yeah. <laughs> you used to have, you used to have, you know, you got the PT standards were a lot yeah. tighter. Right. You yeah. know, but yeah, man, yeah, your hands are getting ready. Uh, the king's going to wrap up with this. All right. That's what you got. That's what you got. Uh, this little boy, we got here. Yeah, yeah, come on. Oh, but bottom line is the, the hands of these people uh, is getting ready to wax people, man. That's right. Yeah, it talks about the king of Babylon, which is representative of your president. Yeah. Even though he's just a, a figurehead, a puppet. Right. right. But yeah, all, all y'all's hands is fixing to wax people, man. That's right. And your uh, hearts are gonna uh, uh, melt, man. Fail you for fear. Fail you man. for fear. Yep. Uh, Come against her from the uttermost border. Open her storehouses. Cast her up as heaps and destroy her utterly. Let nothing of her be left. So, you know, America is just going to be a, a, a barren wilderness. Huh? Yeah. Meant for nothing but jackals and, you know, satyrs. Slay all the bullets. Let them go down to the slaughter. Woe unto them for their day has come, the time of their visitation. The voice of them that flee and escape out of the land of Babylon to declare in Zion the violence, I mean the vengeance of the Lord our power, the vengeance of his temple. Call together the archers against Babylon. That's the that's those stumbling this little missus, man. Alright? Uh all ye that bend the bow camp against it round about. Let none thereof escape. 
recompense her according to her work, according to all she have done. Do unto her, for she have been proud against the Lord, against the Holy One of Israel. So see, because you've been proud against the Lord, you've exalted yourself above all that is called the Most yep, High, Yahweh, right. Shem Yahweh, right. right. you've uh, destroyed people of the Lord, and all that, man. Yep. And so for all those things, yep. this is the recompense and the judgment written. That's right, brother. And that's why this uh, place is going to get utterly destroyed, man. Yep. All right, because of all of the blasphemy, all the things that you've been doing over the course of these hundreds of years that you've been in power, Okay, and the Lord is fed up, uh -huh. you know. And, uh, you know, we, we read in Isaiah 47 a little bit earlier, uh, 20 in the chapter, it talks about <clears throat> you didn't consider the latter end of your yeah. doings, man. Yeah. So yeah. You when, when you were setting up your empire, when you was, you know, uh, whipping Jake, when you were, uh, you know, basically when you was establishing your government over here, uh, uh, you weren't considering the latter end of the things that you was doing. That's right, man. Then when you... Uh, circumnavigated the globe and did all your other wickedness, you weren't considering the latter end of those actions, man. Right. You know? Yeah. This is the this is your latter end, man. Right. And um, yeah. you know, and one of the points we want to get before we, you know, we wrap up, um, you know, a famine is about to come into this land, man. Yeah, Let me get that and then we can get that set up. So yeah, hey man, it's gonna be a famine, man, not only of the words of hearing the Lord, yeah. but it's gonna be a famine of actual bread. Man. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Because they're orchestrating this, yeah. you know, because yeah. they want uh, to use, uh, you know, the bare necessities of life yeah. as leverage yeah. for you to. Because once you take away a person's food, yeah. a person's safety, especially in this yeah. safety and comfortability, yeah. Yeah. man, they're likely to do whatever you want them to do, man. These and they know that yeah. they're using it as a tactic. Yeah. These. Yeah. That, that's right. These wicked elites. They got a. They got a henchman named Henry Kissinger, mm -hmm. and years ago, Kissinger said. Using food as a weapon was that what? Th yeah. That that would be all you would need, man. Yeah. Because once you talk talking about starving the people out, they're gonna do it. You gonna do anything, man. Up and including yeah. up and to yeah. and including a uh, candle yes. yeah. and drinking your own blood. That's yeah. what the scriptures talk about. Yeah, the scriptures goes into that, man. Because that happened once uh, yeah. in 70 A.D. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. but it's gonna turn around and happen again. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Because you're about to be under siege out here in Babylon. Yep. The like, days of no, plenty is over. Man. That's right. That's it, man. Yeah. Yeah. And they're they're uh they're orchestrating a famine. They're setting up for it to be a famine. That's why you have those uh you know those cargo ships, those containers, not being you know uh, not coming to the coast, man, and being off those. They want that. And guess what's gonna happen to that food? It's gonna rot. It's gonna perish. And they're gonna end, they're gonna have to end up throwing it away. And guess what? They're gonna call the famine. Why hell? Let me ask you this. If you can fill a football stadium with 90,000 people, okay, why can't you get dock workers and longshoremen to get these crates, these containers, these shipping containers onto, and they onto a tractor trailer and get them out of the port? Yeah. yeah. Don't you see that there's some nefarious things going right. on out here? Right. And a lot of these things we get, we're saying the elites are manipulated, and they are. But you know what? Y'all about to see me on our side. It's causing me to do these things, man. Yeah. Because he says he's the one who forms the light and creates right. right. All right? Yeah. And then also, too, Most High is sending uh, locusts on your crop. That's right. He's drying up the river. Yeah. He's, he's, he's flooding out your crop. Rats. Rats. Uh, mice. Mice plagues. Oh, come on, man. So there's a lot of supernatural things. And yes, there is a lot of manufacturing yeah, going course, on, of man. Of course. But also, there's, uh, yeah. like the brother said beautifully, there's also a lot of supernatural things yeah. that Yahweh yeah. Shem Yahweh Shah is setting up yeah. to cause that famine yeah. as well, man. Right. Right. Uh, Amos 8 and 11, Behold, the days come, saith the Lord Yahweh. I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread nor thirst for water, but of hearing the words of the Lord. Okay? And that's, you know, uh, that's talking about that first famine. This famine is going to be more drastic. Then uh, the actual famine of yeah. food, but the famine of food is gonna come too. But this right here is gonna come first. Right. Once Yahweh uh, Shem Yahweh shuts up the mouth of uh, the prophets, right. okay, you know, and you ain't gonna be able to. Cause hey, um, let me read on. And they shall wander from sea to sea, yeah. and from the north even to the east. They shall run to and fro to seek the word of the Lord, and shall not find it. So you're gonna be running like a chicken, like you know, like they say, a chicken with your head cut off, trying to find the word, but not gonna be able to find it. Like the brother said earlier, might come around this spot, might be a, uh, might be a lot of you Jakes up here knowing because you see something I've going on out here. You know you see yeah. us. Yeah. Yep. You know they see us, and they haven't, and if they haven't seen us, they yeah. see brothers like. Minded on YouTube, right. and then they've seen us, right? 
<laughs> yep. Like, just because they see no, like, okay, they probably didn't listen, they probably didn't stop. Like, they didn't know they were talking. Yep. Hey, we done got many times, oh, y'all need words like yeah. So, come on, man. Like, that's why it says they're going to be running to and fro, oh, man. You need looking for a count. Yep. You need looking for somebody, man. Somebody. You be desperate, man. You can be desperate. Yep. Yep. Uh, yeah, yeah, because we started off by, you know, by talking about, you know, the, the so-called, this, this, this shipping crisis. You know, this, this whole thing is, a, you know, I'm not going to say the word, but a FF. Yeah. Fill in the blanks, okay? Yeah. And getting stingy about what you can say about, about a minute. But, you know, going in the stores and seeing empty shelves. I mean, hell, I asked somebody for some honey the other day, bro. I wanted some hot tea. I was in a, uh, where the hell was I? Where the hell was I? Oh, I went to a bookstore the other day, right? Mm -hmm. I, I, and, and I was just going to read for a minute, so I was like, I need to buy some, you know? So I, I went out and I ordered a, a hot tea, a blackberry tea, a herbal tea, mm -hmm. and I asked the lady for honey. She said, no, we, we're not getting honey no more. So th this is real, man. Yeah. This is real. And, it, and the scripture talks about the day of the Lord coming upon you like a thief of night. You're going to wake up one day and the day is going to be, and everything's going to be dried up. Yeah. It's going to have it right in front of your face. Yeah. You know? yeah it's going it's to be an ultimate thing when yeah. you know that you've heard this yeah, before. Exactly. We, and we talked about it. Exactly. I told you. It's shame, man. It's going to feel the same. 2nd Ezra 6 and 22. And suddenly shall the song places uh, appear unsung. It says suddenly. So suddenly. So, suddenly, on a sudden, right. All of a sudden, shall the song places appear unsung. Yep. So look at all the uh, out here is the song places, man. Yep. Grocery store, a, a, a supermarket, gas stations, this, that, the third, bars, restaurants. Yep. Uh, the full storehouses shall, shall suddenly be found empty. Suddenly they're gonna be found empty. The cargo's not coming no more, man. And then everybody's gonna go off on a panic buying spree, yeah. you know. And then that's when, bro, that's when all oh, let 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 you not eat in a couple days and see what Bruce. But well, we already know, because we see it. Well, uh, uh, 70 AD when uh, uh, the Vespasian and uh, 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 Titus and Vespasian, what they do? They cut off the food yeah. supply. Yeah. So you had Jake eating each other. Man. Yeah. You take, uh, you take, uh, no, 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 what is going to happen? And drinking blood. And, and for, drinking for blood. thirst. Yup. Yeah. Come yep. on, man, and that, that shows a lack of faith because we're not going to stoop to that lower level. You know, no, we're going to depend. Man, we, we got uh, instances like that you're getting fed by, yeah. by the brook, by, by rape. Yeah, yeah, Elijah. Elijah, yeah, I mean, it's yeah, like yeah, Elijah yeah, being uh, yeah, yeah. fed by a brook. Yep, yep, by, by, by a raven. That's right. That's Come right. on, man. That's right. By a brook. Look, that's right. water. And then exactly. the raven exactly. is dropping food. Food and water. So yeah. that's a beautiful picture yeah. of food and water. Yeah. You don't get no better than that. And he might have, he might literally have you by a, 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 a spring of yeah. fresh water. Yeah. You got to have that kind of faith, man. You got to. You know, it's uh, written. Yep. Second Edges 15 and 16. For there shall be sedition among men and invading one another. Yeah. They shall not regard their kings, nor princes, and the force of their actions shall stand in their power. Yeah, you know, we always go into that, man. And you see that now. Yep. Under all the uh, protesting. Yep. There are people protesting everywhere. Yep. And, and that, that voice is growing louder and louder here in America. Man. People are, are walking on it. They call it October Strike Tober because so many employees are coming out of They are sick and tired of this, man. Yep. And it's going to get to a fever pitch. You know, problem, reaction, solution. We all talk about it. That's right. For because of their pride, the city shall be uh, troubled. The houses is lucky. Uh, a man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. For because of their pride, the city shall be troubled, the houses shall be destroyed, and men shall be afraid. A man shall have no pity upon his neighbor, but shall destroy their houses with the sword and spoil their goods because of the lack of bread and for great tribulation. And there you go right there, man, because, hey, uh, it's going to come, take the trouble, it's going to come, and that's going to come with uh, 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 them shutting everything down. Okay, martial law, you won't be able to go to the next neighboring city if you wanted to. All right, and there's going to be a lack of bread and great tribulation, and you're going to have Jake and everybody, you know, uh, uh, fighting like animals for, you know what I'm saying, for uh, uh, food, man. Yeah. You know? And literally, literally like animals, man. Literally. Because you're not going to have no regard. No. You're, you're going to have a deadness in your eye. Yeah. You're going to have no regard for human life, no, no regard for your best friend. No. I don't care who it is. Yeah. Your your relative. Yeah. That instinct, that carnal yes. nature yeah. that animals yeah. have is going to come oh, out yeah. in, right. in you, right. especially y'all eat McDonald's. Right. 
uh, uh, you're, you're eating uh, 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 human meat anyway, right. and with all this other stuff. So that human meat taste is gonna be, it's, it's gonna be activated. Oh, oh yeah. And then you know what I'm saying, especially with y'all getting this serum. There ain't no telling what when they turn up them frequencies. What right. the hell y'all gonna do? They hit you with, with different frequencies. They gonna be, they be man. Come on. But yeah. Hey, yeah. right. hey. Hey, Lord willing, you know, he was edified through the spirit. Bottom line, man, this place is about to be destroyed. That's right. So it's time, you know, the scripture says, you know, it's time to come out of that slumber, man. That's right. It's time. It's time. It's, time. it's high time, man. High time. You know to what I'm saying? Out of sleep. Wake out of sleep. That's right. Because uh, this place is through. So if you are uh, one of the Lord's people, you got to repent, man. That's and right. come back and you have us in that shot. That's right. Hey, Lord willing, it's edifying with that. I'm going to give all glory and praise to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Bashem, Rekakadash. Double honors to the venerable apostles, the great most stone, along with the elders. Citations so I came out there laboring necessary and truth about the four corners of the earth. Shalom. Shalom. Huh? <laughs>